Hi, my name is Laura, and I'm a youth host at, at the Wisdom to Action event today. My name is Shay. I was a youth host slash facilitator person. A Wisdom to Action event is very unconventional. It's a place for like-minded, passionate adults and youth to come together and share a space. As it's very different from the traditional sitting down at a conference and listening to someone speak. I think they really value participant voice, particularly youth voice in this case. Whatever their passion may be, whether it's indigenous, uh, LGBTQ community, you know, it, it varies. It just seems like it's a safe place for us to come together and really try to move forward and move in the right direction. My favorite are the fishbowl and open space because it allows for critical reflection. There's one small circle in the middle and then there's a larger circle on the outside. And everyone that's on the outer circle has to be completely quiet. And for some people, like myself, that can be very challenging, like holding space for other people. And then the people in the middle, they have a conversation. Uh, I think it was about like 15, 20 minutes for them to have like back and forth and talk about like pros and cons and their experiences of youth engagement and adult ally, allyship. And then everyone on the outside observed. Then they got the chance to switch places. So the people sitting on the outside, whoever wanted to could go into the fishbowl and sit in the center and share what their thoughts on what they heard. And then the open space allows people to expand that conversation from the fishbowl and still look at it with a critical lens and elaborate on their thoughts. I found that a lot of the themes that were made to create the questions for the fishbowl translated strongly into the open space conversations. Uh, people from various agencies came in and presented and had conversations about um, youth engagement like they're agencies that work with youth. And uh, a lot of them were asking for feedback. One thing that really st strikes me that someone said I can't stop thinking about is the difference between mentorship and sponsorship and like recognizing the roles that we play within the relationships that we have with youth, either as peer-to-peer -peer youth or um, adult allies and how important that is to distinguish the role that you have and also like know that that role is significant to the youth regardless of what it is. I would like to assume that it would be inspiring. Like look at these young people and all that they're accomplishing and all that they're doing and they're making a difference and they're passionate and that's how I would assume that adults would see it and how I would hope they would. Our youth, our youth deserve it.